I'm going to miss him. A familiar face in both television and film. What a loony. The sanest man I ever knew in my life. A scene stealer. Don't get too smart. Pretty smart myself. With that unforgettable, ever-present mustache. I guess me and your grandma are going away, David. Wilford Brimley's decades-long career made him a household name. One of his best-known roles, a retiree rejuvenated by a magical pool in Cocoon. Brimley, notably, was only 49 years old when he started filming the movie. Director Ron Howard remembers Brimley as a very inventive and thoughtful actor, saying his influence on the movie was wonderful. Even in smaller roles, Brimley made a lasting impression. Fella, you don't start playing ball at your age, you retire. Appearing alongside Robert Redford in The Natural, now it's my job to give you the picture. And Tom Cruise in The Firm. Most of you don't know what's going on around here. Starring as Dr. Blair in the sci-fi horror movie The Thing. Director John Carpenter called Brimley the real thing. A real cowboy, a great actor, a wonderful man. I can't think of a healthier way to start the day. Brimley later became a longtime spokesman for Quaker Oats. It's the right thing to do. He also appeared in ads for diabetes testing supplies. Hi, I'm Wilford Brimley and I've had diabetes for about 20 years. A gig that made him an internet sensation. And I get all my diabetic testing supplies from Liberty Medical. <laughs> Complete with a Saturday Night Live parody. Brimley is now being remembered by his manager as a man you could trust. He said what he meant, and he meant what he said. He had a tough exterior and a tender heart. For today, Joe Fryer, NBC News. Wow, that's an incredible career. And I, I'm just struck by how he said he was he was 49 when he was filming Cocoon. Yeah. Wow, he could play anything. Ron Howard also said about him, he said <laughs> that... Uh, he could be a little difficult to work with on set, a little curmudgeonly, but he had some of the best instincts of any actor he'd worked with. Mm, and oh, that walrus, sure. that walrus mustache. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That walrus mustache. We'll miss that.